All right, what's up people of YouTube? Your boy, The Universal Gamer, here coming at you guys with another gaming collections video, and I will warn you ahead of time, I don't have that many DS and 3DS games at all. Um, not that I don't like them, it's just that I just, uh, I just don't have that many, you know? So, um, with that said, let's go ahead and get it started. You guys already seen some of these already, so let's go ahead and, you know, go start popping them up. Got The Legend of Zelda Link Between Worlds, 3DS. Legend of Zelda, uh, you know, Ocarina of Time 3D. 3DS, if you like the original game, no matter if you beat it a hundred times, trust me, you play this again on this damn thing. Actually, I feel like playing it right now, just thinking about it, but, um, you know, bam. Legend of Zelda Spirit Tracks. Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass, I got two copies of that. This is unopened. Got Dementium 2. Uh, one of the first handheld scary games not really all that scary but you know it did a good job too on a ds you know it was working with the capabilities of the ds so did a good job i love the booklet inside this game just the fact that they paid attention to detail when making this damn thing you know to make it feel like you got an actual full game even though it's on a handheld you know i, I love it and like I said in my last video, the I do have the game. The game is just inside one of my uh, DS actual cases. And I do that on purpose too. So if somebody ever break into my house and think that they scored when they break into my man cave, motherfucker, it ain't nothing inside my game cases at all. Unless they unopen or unless I like to keep certain games inside the cases, inside the hardcover case or whatever the case may be. Dementium 1. The Ward. Was a good game for his time. Second one. You know played better than the first one but for this to be a ds game handheld and stuff like that they did a good job with these games and i don't know why i got the booklet inside here let's see how this one looks. i forgot how this one looks so this one right here is just a little basic one and stuff like that so and the last boss fight inside i think it was this one was freaking so ridiculous i had to look at a youtube video to figure out uh how to do it and let me go ahead and go back to this booklet because i realized i didn't have my autofocus on when i was showing this one so let's go ahead and dig this one back out. You know, show y'all some close-ups again. Just a little bit of close-up. You know. Last but not least, and this in particular franchise, I'm a somewhat of a fan of it. I'm not a huge fan. I got one and two, the first two games on the PS2. And I haven't really played the in-between games. I haven't even played the second one, even though I own it. And that is Kingdom Hearts. You know, for the 3DS, got this with a gaming trade. You know. Basically, I'm staffed up at Comic-Con. And, you know, they gave us, last year they gave us tickets to give out to people if we want to bring, uh, want family members to come. Even though it was sold out, it gave us the ability, ability to still be able to purchase you know for people to still purchase tickets with this code even though it's sold out so that's pretty much what it was gave this person i think two a two-day pass i think a friday and saturday or something like that or thursday and friday and you know i got this I haven't played it yet he kept it inside mint condition you know I haven't even touched this game yet I haven't even put it into my 3ds yet everything's still inside i actually got this posted on craigslist trying to sell it for 140 bucks or best offer it goes for 140 to 200 dollars used brand new it goes for uh around 260 to 300 dollars brand new so the original price of this i think was 80 bucks brand new and just the fact that i can get it i can get i can sell this and get you know more than what it costs brand new you know it's amazing go ahead and dig through some of this stuff it comes with a lot of stuff and I'm surprised nobody haven't even tried to buy it from me yet, you know. But it's all inside mint condition, man. You got all these covers from all the games and stuff like that. I did look through all this stuff, but I haven't, haven't even put the game into my 3DS. Maybe one day when I'm done beating a lot of games, I need to catch up on. And I just feel like playing a handheld or if I go somewhere traveling. I'm supposed to be going to another country next year. That's, that's uh, you know, can't talk about that. All I can say is... Um, I'm filming a documentary while I'm there, but you know, I'm not gonna tell y'all why I'm going there for. I can tell y'all, but you know, stuff might get leaked and I don't want nobody to find out. But um, here's the game. Like I said, the game is inside there. I'm not perpetrating, you know. 
the game is in there baby there's so much like it's so much art and nostalgic stuff that comes inside this whole bundle and you see i'm trying to take this out and the reason why i'm doing all this because it's a short video anyways is to show you guys all the little different you know artworks here's the um ar cards aka augmented reality here's the little 3ds case it doesn't fit mine of course it's for the original size so yeah man pretty pretty decent bundle you get so if you're watching you want to buy this for me you, and you don't want to pay for pay for shipping sell it for like 120 bucks maybe buy yourself for 100 because i ain't i'm not gonna even play this for like a whole i had this for about a year already it's been a year and I ain't gonna even play it for like another year. So, you know, I was just, I don't be having time for handhelds. Either I'm doing YouTube videos, gaming on the PS3 or PC or three or you know uh, Xbox One. Or you know, whatever. So with that said, man, thank you guys for watching this video. That's gonna conclude my DS slash 3DS games. It's been your boy Universal Gamer. Thumbs up, subscribe, give it a like. That's the same thing as some thumbs up, but whatever the hell, ever, whatever. It's been, <laughs> it's been your boy, Universal Gamer, and I'm out. Peace.